one of the major complaints that patients have is uh, weakness of the legs and difficulty walking. We really did not have any uh, satisfactory treatments until uh, we, uh, until dalfampridine, uh, which is marketed as Ampira, was, was approved. Of course, we have walking aids and braces and canes, which can be helpful, but uh, dalfampridine is an effective treatment uh, for walking problems and leg weakness in uh, patients with multiple sclerosis. The drug was brought to the market uh, uh, after having clinical trials that showed um, uh, an improvement in gait, uh, increased speed in walking in patients who had gait difficulty, uh, and is FDA approved for that uh, and can improve patients' gait, but also has effects on other multiple sclerosis symptoms, in, including fatigue and, and things. Anywhere where it can improve, in, improve electrical transmission, uh, one might see an improvement in symptomatology. We have shown in other studies at the University of Rochester and others elsewhere have shown that walking speed actually predicts and correlates quite well with other aspects of walking impairment such as ability to walk a longer distance or climb stairs or even stand for long periods of time. So in practice uh, what we find is that we use the standard dosing of 10 milligrams twice, twice daily as a starting uh, point and we discuss with patients after several weeks of, of experience whether or not they have improvements in their walking abilities that outweigh any side effects such as paresthesias or insomnia that they may be, ex be experiencing. The main risks uh, with this medication um, it do include seizures and that's uh, much more likely in patients who have uh, poor kidney function so that's something that should be monitored while patients are on this medication. Um, this medication doesn't help everyone. It really helps um, only at best about 50% of patients. So my recommendation for patients is to start the medications, take it for six weeks, stop it for two weeks, and see if it has made any significant difference in their lives. Um, it is a medication that you take twice a day, once in the morning, once at night, and it's important to um, advise patients to keep um, to separate the two doses by at least 10 to 12 hours.